look inside the eye through the cornea, through the anterior chamber, and it's kind of a, a window to the soul and to the body. Red lumbostoma is an eye cancer in infants uh, with most cases that occur uh, before the age of five years. If you look at the eye, then you have uh, kind of different chambers. You have the, in the anterior part, you have the cornea and then the anterior chamber, the iris and pupil lens, and in the posterior part, you have the retina. And this is where this tumor, retinoblastoma, it comes from the word retina. That's where it originates. So it's a genetic mutation. Actually, you need to have two consecutive mutations and two alleles in both genes, which we know today, uh, the origin of the gene. It's the RB1 located on chromosome number 13. You need to have two consecutive mutations in order to develop a clinical disease. Those germline cases, they're already predisposed. They have one hit, one mutation, and then if they develop a second one, and that simply happens. It could have happened to you and me when we were children, but we had the second gene to protect us. Those children don't have that, and they develop the disease. About 50% are non-germline, so they're born without any mutation, but as part of growing, they develop one mutation, and uh, unfortunately, they develop for no reason, I mean, there are no external reasons like uh, sun exposure or cigarette smoking or uh, any other external sources. And there's another subset or another group which is part of the germline cases where the disease can be inherited. That's called familial retinobosoma or a child with positive family history. So we have a, a retinobosoma survivor. It's a young child who had retinobosoma, was detected early enough, treated. Uh, he survived and uh, he got to childbearing age, brought a new child, and he inherited one mutated gene. And then that newborn developed the second hit. He passed on that gene. The most common presenting symptom of retinoblastoma is what we call loikochoria. That comes from Greek. Loiko is white, choria is the pupil. It's a white pupil. So nowadays we all have the smartphones with cameras and we take photos all the time. Uh, but when you have a white uh, tumor and retinoblastoma is white, a, a, what we call amelanotic, no pigment, then the reflection is, it's a white reflex. It's a curable disease. In high-income countries, nearly 100% of the children survive, they make it. There's no reason why the 85% of children across the world don't make it. The eye is simply incredible. Look inside the eye, through the cornea, through the anterior chamber, through the pupil, through the lens, through the vitreous, and it's kind of a, a window to the soul and to the body. So that still fascinates me till this very day.